Okay, so we've made it back today. We are going to probably do a once over back here since people are going to be in and out of it and getting ready to go on their trip. But overall, it looks way better. And knowing that all the heavy soil and uh, manure and everything is off of the walls, out of the floor, and out of it entirely. This is actually a sleeper. That big wall here that's diagonal goes into a room that goes over the fifth wheel hitch. And it's a really nice sleeping area and living area. And you wouldn't even know it had the room for that. But man, it's nice. Anyway, so we're going to finish it up. We did start to clean the other side. As you've seen, the tires were a little cleaner on that side. And a little bit of the dirt was knocked off. But not entirely clean. And I still got to get on the roof. Finish that side. And do this whole side. And it's turned into two short days worth of hard work for one person with so no help. here I go making my way around treating all this with simple green letting it sit for a few minutes after saturating it and then pounding it off with the electric pressure washer and I've went all the way down this side I'm going across the back where you see the dirt cut off right there to this side and then I'm going to shoot back up to the front, come back down, and the, another once over wash all the way around. And then I'm going to clean that out with a quick once over rinse here, too, on the inside from all the debris and fallout that's going to happen as I'm going around getting these gutters here. And then. I will look the wheels and tires over one last time and okay, okay so I got the bugs up there we wrapped around got all up under here even dressed that tire did all the metal around the bottom got all those grooves and gutters around the top where they tend to get green and black stuff especially in these areas it was really bad and I'll tell you another thing that was kind of hard to get to that was bad is these wheel wells and because it's that stainless it gets really corroded and so just finding little areas that might get looked over like up there around that light and up inside here all the little cubby holes around the back bumper all these little areas very easy to overlook and uh, I imagine if you're in a hurry you would tend to miss a lot of those areas here and there but i was able to come back and spend a second day looking it over starting on the roof and then wrapping around we got it looking pretty sharp and tires and wheels were the last thing after closing them windows and getting all in Thank you.